Sean, just before we start with an enthralling 2-2 draw, just a, a word about Seamus and the early signs on how he is. Yeah, no news yet. Um, it doesn't look too good. Obviously, it was a twist and they're always the ones you worry about, but we'll wait and see. But obviously, we, we hope it's not too serious, but I think it looks like more of a serious one than not. Obviously, I mean, such a popular figure with the club as well, and how he must have been. With yeah, you absolutely. Well. I mean, look, he's been he's been terrific uh, since I've been here, and I'm sure before that, um, you know, with my knowledge of him growing uh, by the weeks, and you know, he, he's bound to be a player that, that we miss with his his general all round uh, all round demeanour and his understanding of the cause for Everton. Uh, but I thought Pato did really well. You know, not easy to come on into that game at that stage, and I thought he did really well. Played strong. We know he can play. He had energy, and uh, and you know he'll be pleased with that, and he should be. And just about the game in general, how are your thoughts? Is it seems yeah, to really, a better look, team? Yeah, I, I mean, look, overall we come away, we dominated the chance count, we dominated the, the, the box count, as in getting quality into the box. I must make clear, I don't want to change my story. The chance count is a funny one, but tonight it was, it was easy on the eye. You know, these are good chances. We're creating good chances, good moments. Not just, you know, shots from distance, hitting people's shins and all them sort of chances. You know, and that's the key for me is, is having the freedom to go and create proper chances. And you could see that. And the mentality was great. You know, I mean, look, a couple of mistakes. And you, I've got to be honest, you know, you come off half time, you, I am scratching my head with that one, you know, but that's football for you. Um, and then Jordan makes a great save as well. Um, and, and I think they're them kind of uh, moments that we've got to eradicate from a performance, but lots of good in tonight's performance. We've got to take that into the four games coming, of course, but there's a lot of good in that performance. A really impressive opening again. And this time we got our rewards. So how crucial was that? Yeah, well, it's a uh, good play. Um, Dom's looking fitter and sharper. Um, I mean, he misses a chance, but he's in there a lot now. He's getting in, in, in the right areas again. He's playing stronger. and he's, But, you know, he looks stronger. He looks sharp, which is great. Finishes a penalty, makes a penalty, finishes a penalty. Um, but I thought I thought the whole feel of the performances, you know, not just about Dom, the whole feel, the energy, but also some of the, the, uh, the level of quality going into their box was really pleasing. And how frustrating was it, though, to have it dominated for such a large period that first half, as you say, two come in, two one down? Yeah, I mean, look, the, the madness of football, you know, I, I, I mean, you know, two soft moments for us in a, in a very, very strong half. Um, and the penalty as well, you know, I mean, it's a, it's a bit of a weird nowadays, you know, he doesn't actually throw his arm at it, but they get given. I understand that. Um, so, I mean, you think of it and you come away going, how, how, how is that football? But it is, that's football. And I thought the mentality at half-time to take on the second half, I made it clear to him, I said, this is right in your hands, lads. You can you could feel it. You could feel it in the stadium, you know. And, and fortunately, we went out and, and gave another strong half as well. And, and, you know, that's one of the most pleasing things because other, other times goals have gone against them. We look like it defuels too quickly recently. That didn't. That look ever went, no, no, we're, we're back on top here. And we were for large parts of the second half as well. Is that one of the key takeaways from today, the fact that 2-1 down when we really shouldn't have been because we were dominating, but we still came out and showed that character and fight? Well, to be honest, look, it's, it's a tough call for me because you know, the, the noise changes quickly, ever. And, you know, we, we, we get a point down at Chelsea, we get a point against Tottenham, 10 men, and we're all up. And then we have a couple of rough spells and a couple of performances not good enough. Um, but not the whole performance, you know, it changes quickly because the mentality has been pretty firm. I know, you know, we're a point per game since I've been here, but the reality is before that, I think it was five points in 12, you know, I mean, we're making, we are making strides, but we've got to make them quickly. I've said that all the time. And tonight's a real big shift back to what we expect from each other, not just from anyone else, from each other. Fans are amazing. Again, they have been, uh, but they've seen their, their side give everything again tonight. And Or, sorry, jumping from a, four, a couple of performances, because I thought them two performances I mentioned, everything on the, on, the, on the performance. And we've got back to that. Now, we've got to maintain that, of course. We've got to go again with that same mentality in tough games that are coming up. And 23 shots on goal, and as you say, really good chances as well. So what will that give the, the belief to the team? Well, exactly that. You want to keep enhancing the belief. You know, uh, you know, Dom's getting in there. He's looking alive. The, the two wide players, I thought they were both very good, especially you know, Alex makes a mistake, but his, his way he con conducted himself after that drive in a, you know, at their left back and Dwight carrying the ball and just causing trouble from being on the front foot, as I call it, and playing on the front foot. So, you know, that, that's a feeling of a performance. Now we've got to keep doing that, but it, it brings confidence. You know, when you're coming away from home, especially all the noise about the Everton away record over two years and all that sort of stuff, but we've gone out there tonight and, and given a large performance or a large dominant performance in many different ways, not just the chance, uh, count, chance count, but also the, the feel. You know, there's a feel in a performance, and I think the Everton fans would have all felt that tonight. And as much confidence as we can take from the shots, how important is it with the likes of Brighton and Man City and their attacks coming on the horizon that we try to get back to that defensive solidity that 
got clean sheets against Arsenal. Yeah, and yeah. Look, I mean, you know, that is the the, the, the challenge and. You know, it's finding that, that framework and freedom, as I use it, with the players. You know, you need a framework, you need an understanding of the defensive side and a base to work from, and then bringing that freedom into the game. But when you bring freedom, the turnover moments are so important, you know, and they're, it's gone against us too many times. They're the things we've got to smell danger quicker, because uh, if we want them to play, which we do, on turnover, you've got to work quickly in transition and be alive in transition. And I think we just switched off too many times tonight. Uh, but in saying that, we were very dominant in the other way. We're dominant with getting into areas, asking questions of the opposition. Felt that we could have scored more goals, maybe should have. Um, but anyway, the performance level and the mentality is, is very clear on tonight's performance, but we've got to keep going. And it's a point that keeps us in the fight, but it's the confidence the gained from this type of... Yeah, I mean, look, you, you, of course you go away, you know, a little bit scratching your head, really, because I thought that's a, that's a winning performance, but we didn't get the win. But it's, an, it's another step about what we want to do and how, how we can change the mentality and the performance, and I think that was clear. And finally, just the Evertonians, you said how good they were. What, what did it mean for that reception at the end, what they thought of the performance as well, and that, how important is that unity well, going Well, the one thing I've learned, um, and I, 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 I have to learn, I don't know everything about it, I don't know everything about the fans, but when, they're given the, when they see the team given their lot and with some quality, of course, that's important. I think they're receptive to that. And we've stepped away from that a couple of times and that's not, not acceptable for what we want either. So I understand that. But when they, when they see the team performing like that, then it, you know, I respect the fact that they do respect the team. Um, the biggest thing for me is to give them something. You know, we're giving them something tonight. And other times we've waited for them to give us and we can't do that. We've got to give the fans something. And I think tonight was a clear example of that. Thanks, Sean. Thank you. <laughs>